Hi everyone, welcome back to the lovely Cyberpunk 2077. I don't know who that is. Uh, <laughs> who's that? Got your number from a friend. Heard you're good at what you do. If that's the God's honest truth, then I've got a gig for you. Uh, call me if you're... Okay. Sorry, one sec. I'm going to go do the uh, Queen of the Road in a minute. Let's just... yes, uh, see who's this. It's V. Heard you had a gig for me. You heard right. I need a driver. So call a cab then. I don't like cabs. They have a bad habit of bolting when things get dicey. Listen, I'm a straight shooter. So let me cut right to the chase. Uh -huh. I heard you're the best in town. Thing is, I like working with the best. And I know the best don't come cheap. I'm not going to get into the nuts and bolts, because if what they say about you is true, you can handle anything. So let's get this settled. You got what it takes? Or are they wrong about you? Uh, I go what it takes. <laughs> What's that to... I'll take the gig. Fuck it. We'll do this after. <laughs> I'm going to spend today, we're going to be basically like going over and uh, spending a lovely time with the lovely Pan Am. Uh, it's fantastic. So she's called us. She basically messaged, sorry if I got interrupted by this. Hang on. I'll, I'll, I'll answer him and then I'll do the proper intro in a minute. All right. I'm in. Japan town then. By the market entrance. Give a few honks and I'll stroll up. Later, V. Later, uh, send in the <laughs> No way. I, I might have heard this uh, uh, of this quest through uh, rumour and intrigue, but uh, it's nice to go and do this. That's pretty fun. Oh, we've already also got to do a few things. Um, we're going to do that. Um, I was thinking about going over and we've got killing in the name of... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's for something else. Anyway, um, play it safe. I'll tell you what, we will do that <laughs> after. Next next time, we're going to do the cinema and we're going to do uh, that quest there next time. But uh, today, um, we found a message from the lovely Pan Am Palmer, who's uh, sent us, called us, actually, in fact, and said the Basilisk is ready for us to go and uh, have a look at. Now, I'm pretty keen for that to happen because uh, she seems pretty excited and um, she's a good character. So, um, along with Mitch and uh, along with the other guys, Cassidy and stuff like that, they message me periodically. I mentioned this to them last time, but. Carol uh, Emeka is on here, and she sent me this. Um, just have a glance at that, if you wish to. So with that, we had a bit of back and forth. I was like, okay, give me some advice or whatever. She says we do fine. Now, it's quite weird that... Um, and that's a, oh, No, not you. Uh, I can't remember who it is. All these lovely people here, they keep wanting me, and they know that uh, we're both sweet on each other. It's very lovely. And they're helping me along. But simultaneously, like, um, warning us at the same time, like, you'll be fine. We already know you both like each other and we, we like... It's nice to know that they like me. <laughs> this is a really good reason because otherwise I don't think it would have happened if I didn't go back and change a few things myself. Right. Just a little more time. Yeah, yeah, you turn it into a goddamn rocket ship. I know. Nice. You right, Mitch? Hello? Here we lads. <laughs> Pan Am, how's it going, love? All ready to go? Hey, V. No, not yet. Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the systems. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the Raffin camp. Which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. <laughs> nice. Fuck, made it look like he just came back from a Corpo War tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. Okay. Well, that's not too bad. Johnny's already pissed off at it. That's a good sign. It's going to be fun. Um, okay. And uh, what about Sol? Because I know that these two were kind of like shaken up she? about it. Let me show you the ropes. It's lovely. Oh, I bet you will, love. Anyway, um, yeah, because Sol kind of was bitching before, so. And Sol, what about him? Nothing for now. We're staying out of each other's hair. Good so he's call. not planning a family council. Of course he is. He just wants to keep me in the dark a while longer. Hmm. Well, who is these family elders he's conversing with? Because aren't you the main dudes, pretty much? Like the first alpha team, like the, wonderful, uh, isn't she? 
Thunderbirds. Let me show you the ropes. Uh, Thunderbirds, Argo. That's you guys. Yeah. Anyway, um, always wanted to take one of these for a spin. You're gonna say some shitty, aren't you? I bet he is. Watch. I, I'm gonna call him on his bullshit. I always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly yeah, how you all those naive dead. Gods Get all right. landed nah. at the front. Oh, I missed the noise. They recruited. They just showed you the tech. Sh Come shut on, up. hop in. Everything is set. I gotta go. No fucking way. Damn. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Okay, right. Okay. Cheers, love. No one said no. No woman's ever got me a tank before. Okay, let me just. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, hello, love. Oh, I mentioned that scar before a couple of episodes ago. When, All right, let's fire her up. And uh, when I didn't know, head. sorry, I let. Her, when I didn't realize what it was for, and I rechecked the thing, it's actually where she got shrapnel wounds there, um, on our first little mission. So, uh, good callback, nice. Damn it. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything ought to... Everything is dandy. Give me a moment. <laughs> I trust her. Go on, love. That's it. Smack it. There you go. Oh, yes! Hello? Uh, is she the driver? <laughs> I'd really not like the not her to be the driver. Model, but Mitch and Bob uh, did what they could. I agree with you. They did pretty well. What do you think? I don't like you driving, but uh, okay. Uh. <laughs> nice and cozy in here. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What, no knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. It's like a mystical oneness. Oh. Okay. I don't know why, but for some for for a weird angle, this might really piss people off. But you look like Meghan Markle. Me? <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, all that one actress from Lost. I can't remember her name. No, even Lost. I can't remember. Anyway. Ever piloted anything like this? No. Why? Don't you trust me? Can I still get out? No. Then I trust you. If it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support. I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay. Okay. If you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. It's R oddly okay. pleasant. You'll see. Have you... wait. I thought you hadn't done this before. What? Okay, this will do fine. Thought I look like the turkey you spotted Burning Man in. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. All right. Doesn't need two pilots. You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Yeah, go on. <laughs> I like shoot some. We're in a tank for fuck's sake. This is awesome. Let's go. Okay. Let me have a go. Pan Am, is this uh? As designed. Oh, that's my no. outfit, by the way. Just before we check, that's that's what I look. Like. <laughs> I might have to change later on, but that's basically what I got. This is all shit. Um, that's, well, that's synchronization what I look like. doesn't happen at the snap so of know. one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. Starting to understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. What? Just put it through a few turns. There you go. Soft ride. Seems a boat. Mm -hmm. She'll fly right over any bumps. All types of terrain. Head towards that wreck. All right. Just getting the hang of this, it's like being in a fucking tie fire. Um just feel good. Yeah. Alright, I can see you've grown bored. 
A little. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. All right. Okay. <laughs> I love this. This is going to come in uh, handy later on. Left. Very good. Keep her going. Okay. Thanks, Pan Am. She's giving me such good encouragement. It's amazing. Thank you. Right. Yes, that's the way to do it. See, it's not too bad. <laughs> I like co pilot doing the tank. It's not too bad. I like the view. It's very lovely. And in fact, right. you know what it does make me feel like? Is this a Halo Easter egg? Because it makes me feel exactly like. <laughs> Hi, NA. Okay. Now let's do some shooting. Stop oh, yes, please. What's on the menu? Don't get excited. The Basilisk is a cargo ship by design. Oh. But it should still be a good time? Yes. I All would. Right. Blast those wrecks. Okay, so press that to lock onto a target. Yeah, that? that's yeah. Okay, that's pretty. That's awesome, man. Good. Boom. Okay, practice is over. Oh no! I wanted to go. Oh. B. Oh. Do you remember what I said about impulses? I wanted to just. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, watch out now. What's happening? Hijacked in. Our what? nervous systems are now linked. Right. Basilisk pilots working in harmony. That why I'm feeling everything doubled? It's sensory feedback. Our systems are intertwined. Would you like to try it out? Am I a homosexual? Yes, I would like to do... What are you talking about? Sex. I... <laughs> Let Pan Am touch you. Oh, Look away, children. Look away. Okay. Uh, I could go for that. Can you feel that? <laughs> yeah. Honestly, yeah. Uh, no idea how people can focus in combat. It's probably not always this intense. How about this? Sorry, have they updated this? So <laughs> it's fantastic. I just want to mention this just to break the tension. Um, is this what Scorpion and Mitch used to do when they rode down in New Mexico? I don't know. Uh, oh, hello. Beautiful. Uh, men and women are completely shaven in the uh, the future. It's beautiful. Okay, Pan Am, don't worry about it. It's only took an hour and a half, but <laughs> I can't. Oh, they found us. We have to get back to camp. He was enjoying that. I have. Well, oh, fuck. Ready for a fight? They're here too, Saul. In full force. Take them out. Then haul ass here and make yourselves useful. We'll go straight to camp. We have to help the family. That's right. And um, you and me, you and V should go back to uh, V's apartment for round two because uh, nah. Was that ten minutes? Ah. Anyway, right. We're almost there. Okay. Are you like all the raffins in the area? Okay, that's Are you fuck? That's the hardest fucking thing to do. Oh shit! I didn't know I could just. Jesus. Is everything? Yes. You turned them to dust. Congratulations. Uh, is is it natural it's that um? Uh. Is it natural that my uh, every time? Wait, no, okay, just to go check. I never really do that. Does, does her, I'm, no, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna say. I, I, I would rather die in ignorance. Let's just go over here. And just go back to whatever we're doing. <clears throat> we're all adults, <laughs> right? Return to the nomad camp, right? That, my love, was fucking. Oh. Oh, we're dressed now. Okay, fantastic.
Uh, hey guys, don't worry about us. We were just making a little love. Uh, getting down tonight. <laughs> All of us, each on his or her own, must think first and foremost of what's good for the family. Hmm. Come on, Saul. If I have to leave the clan, please just say so. Spare me another speech of yours at the very least. I'm afraid you'll have to sit through a few more. Because from this day forward, you will lead this family by my side. I will what? I wish to do this properly, but fine. Have it your way. I was wrong. You were right. That's the truth. May it never happen again. But I, I, I made a mess of so many things. You said... I know. But I changed my mind. You risked everything for this family. Not even knowing whether you'd be welcome the next day. Okay. Okay. Well, I... Many things will have to change. Yes. And to start with, we need to leave this place. Quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course. I will prepare our route. Come on, love. Congratulations. Terrible choice. Fantastic. Beautiful. Thank you. Thanks. I need to cool down, I think. Will you come with me? Yeah. <laughs> well, again. I'm kidding. <laughs> anyway. Um, that was lovely. Look, Pan Am's now the leader of the Alder Caldos. Or, or part uh, head of this lovely fucking thing. It's beautiful. Lovely. And... Interesting day. I feel as if I barely evaded a rapidly approaching train. Hmm. It's pretty close. I don't know if I could have done it without you. Hey, come on. No, I'm serious. We all owe you. So you can count on the Aldecaldas. Always. Huh. Good to know. I imagine it's just because you also got a lovely little sus spot for V, don't Nobody's you, Nobody's behind the bar. That I like. Lovely. Beer? Lemonade? Yes, please. Beer me. To happy endings. To happy endings. Um, I feel like I'm about to puke in front of you, um, love, and that's fine. I mean, uh, what's gotten into you? Think I'm gonna miss our escapades? What? No, no, no. We're not doing happy. Like, uh, um, drink. Know where you're going now? I. Hang on a minute. V. I don't know what to say. Uh, I'm not doing regrets or anything. What the fuck do I say? I don't... Fuck it. Speaking of happy endings, back there in the Basilisk, I hope you don't regret what happened. I regret one thing only. That we had so little time. Guess we'll have to do something about that. Mm-hmm. Okay, good option. Okay, I'm very satisfied you know, with that. You know, this... This could be us. Every day. Oh, Pana. V, you see look her. around. Look at them. They could be your family. Pan Am, what are you... Stay in camp. Join us. Just let me take a, a <laughs> attention building fucking sweep. Uh, no, I'd love to, but the big fucking but I'm dying, love. So, um, unless you can save me, and I'm pretty sure you may be able to. What's gotten into you? I got. I basically got like three weeks, love. A couple of days, maybe. I'd love to, Pan Am. I really would. Mhm. Mm Here comes that damned butt. But I can't. Not right now. Have to finish some things first. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. 
No, grab her and just kiss her and go, look, it's I just not... thought... Uh, forget about it. Go on. I'll think it all over. I promise. So, on the best day of his life, when he makes love to his, uh, like, companion friend, lovely woman, Me? he decides to have an aneurysm. Lovely. Pan Am. I... V, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? Uh, like the day after shore leave. <laughs> what happened? I remember. I... We were talking, then suddenly... You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Where? Somewhere new. We moved camp. Don't worry, we are safe here. For now. Oh, V. Oh, Jay. Don't bitch at me, please. V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. What's wrong? Hey, it's nothing. No, I don't care. She's we're cool. Like she's she's gonna be my wife, Jack. We're gonna have lots of beautiful children. Just back up, bro. Talk to me. I've got cancer. It's getting worse. And the cancer is called Johnny Silverhand. Every Silver single Hands. day. Okay, B, relax. Take it bit by bit. What is happening exactly? To tell you the whole truth, I'm afraid things won't be the same between us if I do. V, listen to me. There is not a thing you could say to me that would change how... I mean, just cut the bullshit and tell me what's going on. Aww. You're a big old softy. Very, she's, she, I think she's... Uh, yeah, it's fantastic. Love it. You know Silverhand? You know Johnny Silverhand? Yes, they sometimes play those oldies on the radio. Why? That's oldies. just it. Johnny's alive. He's sitting in my head. He's what? Am, am I not? Is this some sort of strange metaphor? No. Uh, right, I'm serious. It's a long story. Yeah, it is. That's, long that's, story. Got a job. Fucked it up. Now, Silverhand's personality construct sitting in my head. Bullshit. If you yeah, can well, hear the fucking fucking jets outside, it's because red, it's red uh, out don't really arrow mix. day. Anyway, and it's sorry. getting worse. Jesus, it's that thunder. You are not joking. No, I'm not. Just trying to live with it, survive actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. Uh, right. Well, that's lovely. I mean, I, I really wish you get. Nah, she's gonna help me. I'm not gonna go. She's gonna be all like soppy and. B? I gotta go. Talk to me. I'm feeling better, really. Wait, I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Mitch. She's Finally. in debt. She's. We were worried. Oh, lovely. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay? I mean, yeah, yes, it is. I can stay for a bit, but I can stay for a bit, thanks. Hang on. So you is anything wrong, at home already. We do have some experience in this. This is a good place. We have greater control over the area. The rest will settle in quickly. Okay, and uh, all fine now, thanks. I'm feeling better. I've got my Omega 4. Uh, <laughs> I've got like, my Omega oils in. Much better now. Thanks for your help. I'm glad to hear it. Uh, I can stay for a bit, thanks. Uh, no, I can stay for a bit. Thanks. Oh, I'll stick around for a bit. Make yourself at home. Remember, our offer still stands. If you need help, the Aldecaldos are here for you. And I appreciate that, that. At least we can agree on. If you need anything, you know where to find us. <laughs> at least you can't get past you, Mitch, by the way. Okay, thank you very much. I'm part of the family. Oh, this is some genius. I can tell you've got like a massive... Uh, she loves me. That's lovely. Want me to walk with you? Yes, please. It's all be... I know it's very scary for you because you have no idea 
Uh, I hope you're right, though. I know this area. Back from the old roots. You're really safe here, though. For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. And our vantage points really are much better. Hey! Welcome back to the land of the living. About Appreciate time Sleeping Beauty decided to join us. Hey there. Everyone's got a fucking word to say in this camp, but I dig it. It's like being, it is like literally being in a massive family. Pan Am is now, I assume, my romance option. So that's But you know, then. everything here, it is temporary. All of it. We will soon have to decide what comes next. Hmm. I think you're good. You're going to be a good leader. And, um, yeah. Here's my beautiful ride. It looks fantastic. I'm just getting gimps. Banging. V, back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But I am serious. How can I help? Um, uh, yeah, because if I don't know, I can't convey to nothing. I, v, I, I, I don't honestly, know. not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? He's the one who created the personality construct tech. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? <laughs> oh, and I get to kiss her. Okay. Do you know, you are quite a lovely character and you're well written. I very much appreciate your voice, actually. She's got a lovely voice. And whoever, CD, whoever wrote this character did a good job. Same with Sol and even Victor and Jackie as well. They're actually quite good characters, especially Misty as well. Don't think I haven't forgotten those. And we're going to hopefully head back into Night City and uh, check in with all these kind of people. Maybe upgrade some stuff. And um, But I'll do that in the intro. Outro. Uh, let's Thanks for everything. For being here for me. Take care of yourself. And let me know. Well, just please keep in touch. She's a man eater. Get the funk going. Tick it, tick it, get in. <laughs> oh, man, she's lovely. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be the episode. Lovely to see Pan Am. Bye, my love. She's fantastic. Okay, next episode, we are going to go do the Cinnamon quest. Uh, first of all, though, and then we, hopefully the next thing to do would be the uh, Takimura kind of thing. And I think that might be the one where we're going to go up and we're going to see to uh, Yorinobu's sister and kind of do that lovely thing. I need to pick up one something over there and I need to do some more gigs and stuff like that and all sorts. Uh, and also we're going to go do that uh, clown quest. Where is he? Right there. So it's fantastic. We're going to do that. Side missions and stuff. I am thinking still about doing a live stream. But I think that'll do. So um, stay tuned for next time when we go uh, and have a goof with the clown and um, going around town and doing some stuff. Thank you very much for doing that. Watching all the way to the end. I appreciate that. I'm going to say goodbye. Have fun. Cheerio. TTFN.